How's it going guys? Welcome to another video and today we're going to be trying out the last of these Gino De Campo pizzas and today we're going to be trying out the grilled chicken one. Um, again £5 from Asda this one. Really really enjoyed the last two so I'm thinking why not let's uh, let's finish it off and I'm thinking we're going to like this one too. So what does it say? So we've got we marinate the chicken with rosemary to retain its succulent and top it on an otherwise classic margarita pizza. Big chunks of chicken, we'll have a closer look in a minute once we've read on the back. So we've got a stone-baked pizza base topped with tomato sauce, mozzarella cheese, rosemary marinated chicken, fior de latte cheese and basil pesto, which I didn't know was on there. So that might be, uh, might be, uh, make it even more enjoyable to be fair. So again, we've got the calories, I'm not going to work that out. Um, yeah, let's get the packaging open and we'll have a closer look. Right, so the packaging's off. We've got plenty of uh, chicken on there. Again, we've got the nice cheese balls that uh, melt nicely. Hopefully we'll get a nice bit of cheese pull on this one as well. But yeah, you can see the uh, the pesto there. I think this is going to be banging, if I'm honest. Let's stop waffling. Let's get him in the oven. And then we'll have a close look when he's ready. Right then, guys, it's all plated up. Let's have a closer look at what we've got. let's get stuck into it let's have a go at this bit first then still boiling hot to be fair don't know like there's as much cheese on there uh, on this one compared to the uh, the uh, the spicy meaty one we had yesterday but there's the chicken nice big lumps of chicken on there i've got a bit of pesto as well let's try them out again absolutely delicious you can taste the pesto there but the chicken Proper rosemary taste to it. Nice succulent bits of chicken. Oh, it's delightful. Let's have a bit more. Right, let's have another bit. Oh, like I said, there's not as much cheese on this one as we had on the last one, but you can still really taste it when uh, when you get stuck into it. There's loads of pesto. And like I said, there's plenty of chicken on there. Let's have a bite of this one. Again, I can't stress how nice this chicken is. Loads of it with the rosemary on it. Tastes a little bit of, like stuffing. Gotta love a bit of stuffing, but yeah. Again, nice crispy, uh, nice crispy crust on it. Soft on the on the middle, and uh, nice and crispy on the outside. The base is on point as well. Right, guys, I'm gonna finish the rest of this off, and I'll come back to you and we'll mark him out of ten. I'll see you in a minute. Right then guys, all finished and I've got to say once again, thumbs up to Gino, spot on with this one. Um, lovely, nice garlic taste to it um, with the herbs. Really, really herby chicken on there. The pesto mixed in nicely with it as well. Yeah, I mean, it was lovely. There wasn't as, there wasn't enough cheese on there for me with this one, possibly. Um, did I enjoy it as much as the one I had last night, the uh, the spicy one? Spicy and Dooja, mmm. Not quite, but it's not far off, if I'm honest. Um, I just like a bit of spice and a little bit more cheese. Having said that, there was loads of chicken on there. Again, couldn't fault any of the flavours. There's plenty of flavour in there. Um, and again, really, really enjoyed it. Um, I just think the uh, the spicy and Dooja one is just a little bit uh, a little bit better than this one. So uh, for me, this one's a 9.5 out of 10. Um, and like I say again, five pound at Asda. I thought, I'm not sure where else they sell them to be honest, but I think five pound at Asda um, is probably your best bet. Um, 
But yeah, let us know if you've tried any of these uh, Gino pizzas or if you've tried any of the other uh, products he does, the lasagnas or whatever, uh, risotto, I think he does all sorts. Um, I might venture into them to be fair because uh, I've about outdone these pizzas now I think. But yeah, 9.5 out of 10 for the uh, Gino De Campo grilled chicken pizza. Thanks a lot for watching as always guys. If you haven't already liked and subscribed, you can do so if you so wish. And I'll see you in the next one. Take care of yourselves. Cheers.